Hello again. We're in the New Forest on the south coast of England. During the Second World War, a large valley called Ashley Walk in the forest was fenced off to keep the free roaming ponies out. This valley became a bombing range used to train the bomber pilots. Various targets were built around the valley and we'll come back to those in another video. At the bottom of the valley an illuminated target was set up to enable the bombers to practice day and night bombing. Halfway up the valley a large arrow was built to point the bombers towards the target. We're going to see if we can find that arrow. If you would like to try this, take the track out from Fritham towards Frogham. You'll walk through the forest and then you'll find yourself in the open valley of Ashley Walk. Here we are on the Ashley Walk track. The arrow is very easy to miss. We missed it twice in the summer when the bracken and the undergrowth were growing tall. We've come back today in March. We found it quite easily. This is the concrete arrow up ahead of us. Here it is. You get some idea of the scale of the arrow when you compare it to Edith, the miniature schnauzer. The arrow points towards the target at the bottom of the valley. There's nothing left of that target now to see though. The arrow was illuminated for night bombing exercises using a diesel generator and spotlights. Surprisingly, there's no signage here to explain the background to the arrow and why it's here. I suspect that 99 out of 100 people that walk along the Ashley Walk track walk past this place without even knowing that the arrow's here and the part that it played in Britain's history. I hope you've enjoyed this short video. If you have, please subscribe to see more bite-sized videos, never more than three minutes in length. Thanks for watching.